Hey there everybody, Walking here with the end of the week update. If you don't know, and I don't know why you would, uh, at the end of each week I want to do a bit of a checkpoint because I plan to do a break today, like right now I'm just chilling here. But don't, don't, don't get it twisted, at some point later today I'm going to go to a hotel, clean my clothes, get rid of all these rashes and bug bites and all that, I'm just going to burn them away. Um, but yeah, so... I actually already tried recording this before, actually a bunch of times, and it's a shame because I had a nice sunset and everything, but it turns out I accidentally recorded a time lapse, so whatever. Either way, I want to talk about what's on my mind, things that I've liked this week, things that I haven't liked, things for the future, um, I guess, so let me just do that. So, first of all, uh, I've been enjoying the trip quite a bit. Uh, of course, I've only been showing the best moments most of the time. Uh, so you're kind of getting not a fake version, but you're getting the smiley version. Uh, this trip has been pretty difficult uh, for the first week. Physically, uh, I have been having some foot pain, a lot of rashes, my shoulders hurting. Right now, my neck, I can't bend more than this because of how I've slept. Um, and then also mentally, it's been like a bunch of mood swings. Sometimes I'm so into it, and sometimes I'm like, what am I doing here? Um, so it, the, there's just like a lot of volatility. Uh, but I think it's because I haven't gotten into the swing of things, and it's kind of a weird kind of lifestyle to get used to until you get used to it, you know what I mean? So that that's how that's been going. But as for this week, so much has happened. Like, I'll go back over the footage, and I'm like, I cannot believe it's only been a week. I feel like I've been living this lifestyle for like a month. Uh, I've enjoyed uh, the very beginning, taking the ferry uh, with Francis to Provincetown, uh, getting like slightly tipsy and talking to everybody on the boat. That, that was cool. Uh, then also walking through Provincetown. Some crazy stuff happened, like, you know, sleeping under the bridge, like Francis leaving, like, um, like uh, going th not through, around that military base. At no point did I trespass, but I was just scared that I might accidentally trespass, getting lost. It, it's been, it's been a, a large week. A lot, a lot of stuff has happened, and really, uh, this is kind of a goodbye to the Cape. Uh, because this whole week has been me going around the Cape. I, I went a bit further than I needed to uh, because I wanted to sleep in the yard of Joey's mom, uh, who has a name, but I think it's just funny at this point. It's just Joey's mom. That's what it is. But, um, yeah. Also, uh, a bunch of people have been sending me messages from Rhode Island area being like, you can uh, sleep on my yard. I want to join you walking for a bit. You, uh, let's go to get lunch and whatever. Uh, and I'm looking forward to that. So Rhode Island and Connecticut and new states are coming. That's kind of the next phase of the trip. So the, the whole highlight of this week has been Cape Cod. Next week it's going to be, you know, whatever. I also got contacted by a guy who does a morning show, a morning radio show. Um, and it looks like I'll be doing that at some point. I'm, I'm very nervous for that. Not currently, but I know I will be. I know how I am. Um, I'm going to be nervous for that. But that's exciting, because now I'm getting a bit of steam, a bit of, you know, some stuff's rolling in terms of publication and all that. Um, and other than that, I guess the only other thing I want to say is I'm going to be taking all the episodes that I've recorded so far. So one through six, that includes two and a half and six and a half. I'm going to be putting them all in one video and calling that week one. Uh, so that if you want to see, like, the adventure of Cape Cod in one uninterrupted thing where there's cross-referencing, I say, oh, tomorrow we're going to do this, then you get to see it happen, and etc. Uh, that is going to be available. So, it's going to take a while to upload, though. But I keep scratching my head because I haven't showered, and it is itchy. It's itchy. Um, I don't know if I've... Oh, yeah, maybe maybe last, last thing is uh, I want to, again, thank Michelle... Rodolfo and Rick, as well as Luke, and I might be forgetting somebody, uh, for buying shirts and sweatshirts. Uh, they are funding this trip either directly via me buying McDonald's, or I reinvest it right back into the Facebook page with advertising. So either way, uh, it is going directly into the trip in some sense. So thank you guys for buying the uh, merchandise. And now I believe uh, the Facebook shop should be open, so you don't even need to go to the website. You could just buy stuff directly from the Facebook page, it seems. But, um, yeah, 
So I think that's uh, all I have to do for all I have to say for this update. Um, thank you guys for listening, and I will pr- provide more of that dank, dank entertainment um, soon. And and you know maybe 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 one other thought. I, I've been struggling with the the idea of how do I experience something and document it because I feel like documenting it almost takes my attention away from it. So I've been playing around with certain ideas like documenting but not reading the Facebook comments for a day and stuff like that, even though they're overwhelmingly positive. I've just been struggling to figure out the balance of how do I keep this trip personal but also document it because I really want to. Um, And I think there's a balance there that I got to figure out. But uh, yeah, other than that, thank you for watching. And I will see you on the next one. Deuces.